if you want to set any song or custom audio file as ringtone of your iPhone 16, 16 Pro, Max or Plus without iTunes, then let me show you the most easiest and simplest way to set a song as custom ringtone on any iPhone running on iOS 18. If we open the settings app, go to sounds and haptics and scroll down, we'll be able to see the ringtone option. Just open it and if you already have some songs or ringtones purchased, then you can simply click on download all purchased tones and they will be added to the list, after which you'll be able to choose them. And you can also go to Tone Store and buy your favorite song from there. But in case you already have the song and you don't want to purchase it again, then don't worry. Because it's very simple to add a song that you already have on your iPhone. For example, we already have some songs that we have on our music library, but there is no direct way to use them as ringtone. So, in order to add your custom songs to your ringtone, you'll need to use the Garage Band app, and it should become pre-installed with your iPhone 16. And if you don't have it, you can just download it from the App Store. Then press Continue and Allow. Now it will open the Recent tab. From there you'll need to press on the microphone icon that you see on the top right. After that, press on this icon from the top left. Now just press this loop icon at the left of the settings cogwheel. From here, to choose the music file that you have on your iPhone, you'll need to go to the Files tab and select Browse Items from the Files app. If you have added them recently, then they should be on the Recents tab. If they're not, then you can just browse for them or search by the file name. Now just choose your favorite song and it will appear here. Now to add it to the GarageBand project, you need to hold down on the file name and then drag and drop it into the GarageBand timeline. After dropping it, make sure that the file is all the way to the left and touching the border. Keep in mind that it will be played in a loop. So if you want, you can just select a small portion of the song which will get repeated. To listen to the song, you can use this playhead to move around the soundtrack and find the best bit by tapping on play. When you know which part you want to use, just use these sliders to select a portion and again make sure that it's all the way to the left. And you're almost done. Just tap on this arrow icon and click my songs. This will be saved as a project. Now you can rename the file to the song name and then to use it as your ringtone, hold down on it, tap on the share button and select ringtone. You can also rename it from here. Then just tap on export. As soon as you do that, it will be added to the ringtone settings. And you can also tap on use sound as from the pop-up, then select standard ringtone to save it as your ringtone right from here. Now let's get back to the settings, sound and haptics, ringtone, and you'll be able to see the song you just added right on top. Just select it and it will be set as your current ringtone. And following the same process, you can add as many songs as you want and set them as your iPhone's custom ringtone. And that's how simple it is. So if this helped, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to our channel for more exclusive guides, and I'll see you in the next one.